Yo, what's good YouTube? It's your boy JR back with another banger. And in this video, I'm about to show y'all boys one of the best working NBA 2K21 VC glitches. With this glitch, you can run it up and get as much VC as you guys need for the summer. Make sure y'all boys drop a like, drop a sub, turn on post notifications. Let's see if we can this video to 100 likes. And with that being said, I'm gonna go ahead and get right into the video. I wanna give a shout out to the homie Charles the goat i'm currently using his video footage for this glitch so yeah man shout out to the homie charles the goat his link will be in the description down below make sure y'all boys go check the homie out so to start this glitch off the first thing that you guys want to do is just load up the player that you want to do this glitch on now it might be better for you guys to do this on a player that's under a 95 overall because when doing this glitch you might lose overall if your player is over a 95 so just keep that in mind but step number one is you guys just want to load up the player that you want to do the glitch on into the neighborhood and then uh just to show y'all boys this is how much vc that we started off um before we done this glitch and make sure you guys watch the video and do this in the same exact order as i do just to ensure that you get v vc each time that you guys do this glitch so after you guys load into the neighborhood you guys saw how much vc we're starting off with and like i said you can spam and get a lot of vc just by doing this what you guys want to do is just go ahead and walk over to the cages and then um once you guys get to the cages just make sure you hop on with some people and just let the game go ahead and start up this might go by quicker if you load in with a teammate or so but you guys can load in solo it just may take a moment you know for you to find a game i don't really feel like people take cages that serious at all so you should be able to hop on with any random and then what you guys want to do is go ahead and let the game start up now to ensure that you get your vc all you guys want to do as soon as you guys see um so, as soon as you guys see the in game celebration all you would want to do is just join a friend that you have in the neighborhood so yeah I mean, if you guys don't have a friend in the neighborhood just add a random from the neighborhood you just gotta make sure you have somebody that you can join so as soon as you see celebration start just go ahead and join and you guys will know it's working whenever you see you know your player froze just like this now unfortunately with the cages glitch you can spam it you just can't do it more than once at a time so this is going to be like two vc glitches into one because for whatever reason like i said you cannot spam the cage vc glitch which is kind of unfortunate but when you combine this with a blacktop glitch you can spam them together and like i said you can really just rack up your vc you guys are in the vibes so yeah man um after you guys join a frame you will uh, be loaded into the neighborhood and just to show you guys you will get vc whenever you do this just make sure you do not spam it more than once at a time because if you try to do it like two times in a row three times in a row you won't get any vc so yeah man what you guys want to do is um after you you load into the neighborhood just go ahead and go back to the nba 2k21 main menu and then once you guys get there you guys want to go to your settings So yeah man go ahead go over to your features and then go to your cp user sliders whenever you do this this is going to assure us that we're going to get to these black talk games extremely fast so what you guys want to do is go ahead and load some settings so if you're on uh, xbox triangle ps4 or if you're on xbox y ps4 triangle and then load up a file where it says cpu 0 user 100 this is a very important part of this glitch because it's going to allow us to get through the black talk games extremely fast you guys should see a file like that on both xbox and ps4 you might have to scroll down a little bit if you're on xbox but it definitely should be there you guys will see that this will put the cpu sliders on zero basically making it to where they will not be able to hit a shot and then you'll be able to basically shoot anything that you chuck up so yeah man after you guys do that just go ahead and go to black top go to 1v1 the controller side does not matter and then uh you guys can use any team like i said it doesn't matter and you guys want to make sure you put the game all the way down 
to five because we want to get through these games as fast as possible and then you can, you can literally choose any teams that you want any player in this case we're choosing steph curry and you guys want to go ahead and load up this game now in this game you guys want to get through it as fast as possible you guys will see it is extremely easy to shoot you're able to steal the ball from the ai almost every single time you can literally shoot anything and the key is you just want to get through this game as fast as possible and whenever you do this you're going to be able to get more vc as well so with the black top glitch you cannot spin the black top glitch either that's just how it is after this game go ahead and quit and go back to the nba 2k 21 main menu and then once that happens go back to black top i believe that you can do the black top part twice but what you guys want to do is when you guys get back to the main menu just close out the application and reload the game back up and then this time you guys want to go ahead and go back to black top so I believe you can play two black top games in a row before it stops giving you VC. That's just how it is. So go ahead and start up another black top game. The slider should still be the same from you know where we downloaded at the beginning of the video. And then you can choose any team. You can even pick your own roster if you would like. But you know to make it go by as fast as pick a random team like like we did. And then you guys want to go ahead and start this game up. Make sure the game conditions is on five. And then once again, you guys just want to start the game. And then um, in that game, in the in the black tie game, you guys just want to get through it as fast as possible. And you guys will notice that you can literally shoot just about anything. And then you can steal the ball extremely easy from the AI. And like I said, you guys can do the black top glitch twice before it stops giving you VC. So after this black top game, we're going to go ahead and go back to the cages. We're now able to get VC from the cage glitch again, just because I believe like if you if you uh, do this glitch with the cage glitch, it allows you to spam them both at the same time, if that makes sense. So after this game, you guys will see that you'll get your VC. And then now you guys want to go ahead, go back to the NBA 2K21 main menu and then load up the player that you want to go ahead and do the cage glitch and just keep in mind when doing this glitch if you're a 95 overall or above you will lose overall so yeah man i don't want to see you guys you know lose your 99 or 98 so try to do this on a player that you're grinding out or that's not reached 95 overall just yet so yeah man you guys will see you'll get vc if you do uh, this glitch in the order that i'm telling you to so now once you guys get back into the neighborhood just go ahead and go back to the cages so when doing this glitch do the cage glitch join a friend do the black top glitch um close out do the black top a glitch glitch again and then join into the neighborhood and then you guys can do the cage glitch again and just repeat just make sure you guys do do this glitch in that order just so you're getting vc because if you try to spam the cage glitch or the black top glitch you will not get vc after you do it a couple of times i don't know why that's just how it is 2k try to patch it to where we can't spam this anymore but you know we found a workaround so yeah man if you do it in this order you will rack up your vc each time that you do this glitch so um now that we're back in the cages all you guys want to do is just join a random game and then as soon as you see either team start to do the, the pre-game celebrations all you want to do is just join a friend that you have in the neighborhood if you don't have any friends that play this game just just add a random and join that way but you're going to have to find somebody that you can join once that happens you'll be loaded back into the neighborhood and you guys will see that if you do this glitch in the order that i'm showing you guys you can rack up your vc and you will get vc each time that you do it shout out to the homie charles for this video drop a drop a sub i'm out